Sean Hamlin. What's up, Guard? Sean, you're looking awfully Euro. What's the deal here, buddy? Yeah, I, I definitely look uh, quite a bit more Euro than uh, in the years past. You know, going to be going to uh, going to Europe at the end of uh, January and going there and hopefully bring home uh, bring home some good uh, good rides and some fun. You know, and that's a big thing that I've been missing. I think the last two years was uh, having fun again and you know just need to uh, need to get back at it. So we'll see what happens. So explain to us a little bit about your deal there. I'm going to be racing MX2, so uh, that's the lights for the for the U.S. viewers that don't know. Um, I'm going to be living based out of England is where we're at, and then um, going to be you know traveling all over. We're going to do some testing in Spain and some testing in Belgium, some places in France. It's going to be uh, it's a big move for my wife and I, and uh, looking forward to it. It'll be fun, you know. Not too many people get to travel uh, travel to Europe and and get to have the opportunity that I do now. So. Uh, Definitely gonna gonna enjoy the most of it, and uh, hopefully go out and start riding good again. It feels good to be back on a bike. My mechanic got over from England a couple weeks ago, and been uh, been at it for uh, a couple weeks now. So riding five days a week again and having fun. I mean, it's it's a blast. The bike's awesome. Leaps and bounds better from last year, and looking forward to uh, to a new challenge over in Europe. Cool. So tell us about some of these wacky stickers you got going on here. What's a uh, Taz bar? It is, uh, it's like a European version of eBay, so uh, it's definitely got some money behind it. We've got Relentless, which is uh, Coca-Cola's new uh, energy drink over in Europe. And then uh, obviously you guys see the big Swift across the, you know, the shrouds. That's uh, Suzuki's making a big push in Europe to go after like the Mini Cooper and stuff. Uh, it's a new car that they're uh, promoting and uh, I'll be driving around at the races. They're actually pretty sick. I had one for the week that I was over in England and uh, they're actually really cool cars. So. Uh, Looking forward to that. We got Shell. Got a few other cool ones, but uh, most importantly, as long as the bike runs good and we've got a, a competitive bike, I think uh, we'll be out there doing well. So speaking of a competitive bike, uh, are you going to be getting works parts or any kind of special stuff, or are you just going to be running what every other team would be running? Um, it's kind of kind of both. Um, there's going to be some stuff from Japan that we're going to get, but uh, for the main part, our team's going to work real close with Sylvan Gabor's team out of, uh, I believe they're out of Belgium. Uh, so on a personal note, uh, you just got married not too long ago. How's that going for you? It's actually really cool. Uh, it's it's weird to come home and you know say hi, wife. <laughs> it's you know it's a bit different. I mean, me and my me and my wife now have been together uh, five years before we got married. I mean, she was uh, she was there before everything started. So I figured if she could put up with my crap for that long of a time, uh, there's probably nobody on this earth that could ever do it. So uh, she was definitely the one that uh, I felt would. Uh, that I could be compatible with for uh, the rest of my life. Well, the next obvious question: When's the uh, the little ha little Hamlin's coming? <laughs> uh, not for a while. I, I get to go over and see Langston's kids uh, like on a daily basis. That's enough for you. And uh, for now, it is. You know, I mean, definitely, it's not like it's out of the question or anything like that. But uh, there'll be one sooner or later. Cool. Well, good luck over there, Sean. Thanks.